fabulous! Hey guys and girls, I'm our best and okay. welcome back to an episode of Super Mario Galaxy. So my blind in the last episode we did something. Yeah, we we I, I don't remember what we did, okay, in the last episode. I don't remember what we did. I know it's only been a week since I freaking recorded, but I have a short time memory loss. Well I technically I don't. Um but I I don't have a great memory. Which isn't exactly true either, I just don't remember what we're doing next, this episode. And god damn it, can I freaking get up to a freaking kitchen dome without falling off the freaking thing twice? Anyway, um, during, uh, um, in between episodes, I also discovered something kind of cool. Um, I was in like the Wii menu, and on like the mail thing that was like down here, there was actually like a little icon saying, I have free mail, or you have mail. And there was like three of them, and it was actually from Mail Toad. Mail Toad's messages actually go onto your Wii message board, which is actually pretty cool. I actually um, opened all of them, and I think I'm showing it on screen right now. But if I'm not, then what the hell am I doing with my life, future me? Um, but yeah, that was actually available in the Wii U menu, which I found pretty cool to be honest. And actually, we've already taken out all this stuff. Okay. <laughs> That's what we did in the last episode. We took down Bowser Jr. Um, Airship Pomada. We finished off the Kitchen Dome and in this episode, we are going to be taking on the um, Hungry Luma mission for this dome. By feeding it Serve 600 <laughs> Star Bits, Force Feeding, Transforming, and Miraculous Galaxy, the Drip Drop Galaxy. Drippy Drippy Drop Drop. And going into Lumsar. What do we have here? Giant Eagle, Giant Eel Outbreak. <laughs> giant Eagle Outbreak. And, oh. Ooh. <laughs> oh, we have a old, we have an old freaking penguin right here. That's pretty cool. He's all like shrugging his beard, like back in World War One, back in my day. <laughs> that, that 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 is a really really bad old man accent. Grandpa's getting old. <laughs> you don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> Ever since this big eel showed up, we haven't caught any fish. <laughs> Get rid of those big eels. So we have like a kill everything quest right here um with I guess our uh tello shells right oh we have torpedo Ted as well oh geez all right um so now we've got a tello shell let's go find a giant eel and kill his face um you're a giant eel how about it how about I suck at aiming because that's what I do best um, okay, take another one, and Bushaka Laka. Okay, took out one of them. Uh, wait, I think so. No, no, Torpedo Ted, Torpedo Ted, no, 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 you don't, you don't want to hit me, you don't, you don't want to hit me, I'm, I'm more, I'm more moldy from getting hit, I, you don't want to hit me. Also, what the hell is that, that's one up. Um, I should also be careful of my air because I'm not doing good with air. Um, oh god, he's got my tail, he's got my tail, he's got my tail, he's got my tail. Okay, okay, okay. Now I just saw, I saw a giant eel, I am actually swimming next to it. Let's take it out. Let me just suffer to get some air. <laughs> I, I did it majestically as well, I did like a freaking dolphin dive. Um, okay, now, okay, I got more air. Where is this freaking giant eel? Oh my god! Freaking giant eel! God damn it! <laughs> no, you're a giant eel, but I couldn't get it lined up. You're not a giant eel. Give me a giant eel. Give me a giant eel. 
giant eel where the Jesus Christ I just want some umami umami gets here I've never actually tried umami uh so what was it sushi yeah I've never actually tried to do umami sushi and I don't think I probably will in the future at least not in the immediate future because I don't think they actually sell umami uh, sushi in like my local quote unquote local uh, sushi place um, no, no, come over here I, I, if I want to eat like umami I have to go to like Hong Kong or like Japan or somewhere um, come over here grab this last one that should work nice took them all out and for that we got the star quite an easy one to be honest and Let's just go head on to the pirate ship. Damn it, Mario, I swim faster. And. Star. You got a star. John Eel outbreak from Drip Drip Galaxy. We. Completed. Uh, we did that. <laughs> and wait. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> I thought I thought that um we got brought here because it was like something important. But whatever. Apparently that was nothing important. But you do have something. You have a letter from Luigi. Bro, I got this up, and now I can't get back. This picture shows who I am. Help me. Um, so he's in the battle rock. Uh, so let's grab the picture. Whatever. And we need to head to the battle rock, which is... It's in the fountain, isn't it? I'm, I'm not being an idiot and saying that it's in the fountain when it actually isn't. It, 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 it's in the fountain, right? I, I'm not being an idiot, right? <laughs> I, I, I'm not. I'm not I'm not an idiot. I, I do good. I do good. Um, it, it's... Okay. Battle Rock, be in this place. Bella, be in this place, Battle Rock. And you are there. No, no, you're not. You are there. <laughs> you're there. No, you're not. What is this? But anyway, let's go to Battle Rock Junk. Battle, Battle Junk. <laughs> um, Battle Rock Galaxy. And it looks like we have another green star. Because we have a green exclamation point. Nice. Um, those are heading off to those trial uh, galaxies, aren't they? Now, I think it showed him being, like, right in the, the end of this level. So I think we're going to skip to that point. So, cutting to... Alright, I'm at the end of this place. Now, that's the star that we've already got, but Luigi should be somewhere here. I mean... What, where is Luigi? There he is! Help someone! Help me! Um, so we need to go grab that guy, but once again, getting Golden Vart Bullet Bill friends and following us too. And unfortunately, I got two Bullet Bill friends, so that means that they are going to kill themselves. Probably. Uh, are they? Wow, they actually got to the actual place without killing themselves. Nice. Well, one killed itself because he had nothing else to live for. Why? Fella got crazy in there. Try to save me soon the next time, bro. Yeah, you want this power star, right? Only if you tell us in here. I found this one. Well, <laughs> apparently he, our brother wants us to give a nice word in for him to Rosalina. Mm. Mm. And let's grab the star. Grab, grab, grab the star. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I was like the hardest thing in this level, just getting the star underneath, like, Okay, with that green star gotten, if if gotten is a is an actual word, um, we are going to go to the next dome. The next dome being, of course, the but it it is a bedroom, right? Yeah, it's a bedroom because we're finished off the kitchen, and we're going to head on into the bedroom. I mean, base spotted. We're detecting massive energy spikes. What are they doing there? Well, obviously, being enemies, she is. What well, nice, nice bedroom that the Rosadina has in this place. Mm. Um. Anyway, let's open this next galaxy, which is gonna be Gussig. Oh, Gussigon Galaxy. One thing. One thing that I do know about Gussigon Galaxy, because I have watched. Well, yeah, watch. Slash listen to. 
top t t top 50 songs in video games. This is it. This is it. Yes. I mean, that was a little bit of the actual song, and that, what I remember, wasn't actually even the best part. I think the best part is actually coming up right now. Um, not this part of the song. I think it's... Oh, of course I had to freaking interrupt the goddamn song with getting this freaking pipe. Damn it, freaking game. Give me the Gus of the Garden song. And it started from the beginning, great. <laughs> Unfortunately, we don't get to hear the awesome epic notes that was the Gusty Gun Galaxy theme song. But, you know, live and learn. Um, let's put that. Woo! One up. And, woo! And, stop. Nice. Now, what is underneath this place? We have another of these invisible guys. Come here, invisible guy. I will hit you with my spin attack. You will give me lots of star bits. I will be rich on candy, which is fed to Loomers on the Comet Observatory. I should really start singing now. <laughs> yeah, okay, I'll stop. <laughs> I'm literally butchering that freaking cool ass song. And that is a crime. That is a sin. Nobody will be able to butcher this song. Nobody can butcher this song. Well, <laughs> it's a legal offense to butcher this song. <laughs> Um, no, give me a coin, I do wait, that is a coin, god damn it, I just flattened one guy in the head, and good thing I actually did get a coin, because that guy would have hit me, and that is actually what I need to do. Unfortunately, I don't want to do that, because there's something on the bottom of this thing, and I want to grab it! Um, oh, it's just a coin. Nice, I'll take that coin, thank you very much, by hitting a patch of that, apparently. That happens. Uh, God. Okay, now onto the Sproutle and onto this next one, which is like a lima bean. <laughs> it's the same color as a lima bean as well, apart from it has like a beachy area. Um, now, I don't want to go onto that one just yet. Because there does seem to be something underneath this place. Okay, so let's go underneath to the planet, and this we will have. We have another Sproutle, but to another planet. And now, what does this planet have that the other one doesn't? Um, one of these guys, another one of these guys, and coin, nothing, 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 wow, that, that was a waste of my time, um, okay, we have another one of these guys, ah, wait, what, I flattened its head, I did flatten its head, what do you mean I didn't flatten its head, I flattened its head, like that, like so, and, wait, what, what does that do, because, Okay, I'm, I'm hoping that this one launch star actually takes you to the exact same place as that launch star would if you were to take that. I'm, I'm pretty sure that produces a launch star. Fortunately, I can't go and check very easily, so um, launch star away and hopefully to the same planet. I think that is the same planet. Is it? I think, it, I think this is the planet that you would reach anyway. Either way. Anyway, think and catch me, boy Yang. I Christ Lord, we have a freaking butt catching bunny game again. Oh god. Tag your it! Tag! Tag me! 
God. Okay. Um. Wait. Damn it. Forget. Come back here. Tag your it. Tag. 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 Tag your it. And. Damn it. I overshot him. Tag your it. And they also like touching bunny butts. Here, take this. Tag. Tag your it. Tag your it. Tag. Okay, I'll just say the star. <laughs> star. <laughs> God. Back into the bedroom. We are going to take on Gussie Garden Galaxy's second mission. I think we have enough time. It is currently 20 minutes, but I'm going to shoot for a later, um, a longer episode. We are going to take on Dirty Trick, Tricks of Major Burrows. Now, Major Burrows is another boss that I am very familiar with. Why? Because of the magic of Galaxy 2. Yes, in Galaxy 2, you actually do take on Major Burrows as a part of, like, the... Super All Star Fantastica Galaxy. I think that's what it's called. <laughs> or, of course, close enough. <laughs> it pretty much is Super Fantastica Garden Galaxy, to be honest. So, um, let's pump this. Wait, what am I actually doing with these pegs? Am I just freaking pounding them in to get enemies? Because I am not very. I don't appreciate enemies as much as I probably should, so I don't like enemies. Um, and you can go die. Die by spin, die by my boot into your head. Man, I kicked them into next week. <laughs> um. Okay, let's grab that. And grab. Zeus. Okay. That was good. I'm gonna grab another one here. Okay. Now let's grab. That. One. I don't think I'm gonna get all of them. Nice, nice. I will take all of that yummy, delicious star bits. Now these guys, I think are major. These are like Monty Moles, right? But who, who are the guys who are throwing wrenches at us then? If those things are Monty Moles, which they obviously are, what is throwing? Wrenches at us. I don't get it. Nor do I really understand. Um, where did that coin go? That was weird. Yes, that was the epic part of that of the Gusta Garden Galaxies theme. Oh my god, I do really like that theme quite a lot. Um, now where is Made Monty Mole. Monty, Monty! Hey, Monty! Hey, Monty! I, I heard you like not being. You don't. You, ow. Ow. Screw you! <laughs> hey, Monty, I hear you like rich Italian plumbers! Come over here and I'll butt stuff you into next week! Um. Where the hell is he? God damn it. Where. Where is. Where? Where? I can't. I can't find him. I can't find them. Um, why don't I just wait for him to come to me? That that'd be a good idea, and also the lazy version. Um, is he actually coming over here? Monty, Monty, what? God damn it, Monty! There he is, <laughs> and smack you. Okay, so we have another one to take out because that's what you need to do in this part. Okay, nice he's coming my way, and pushaka. And now we have the launch star. Right. In to the launch star. And Pushka. Uh, Viney Planet. Whatever. Wait, what? What, what? what did that one planet... What, why was that one planet for? What was it for? I don't get it. But apparently these apples are molded. God, they try to freaking give me quote unquote fresh meat. Jeez, obviously this one's been molded. God, and I paid like 10 rupees for this. 10, ten sabbats for this junk. 
Wait, I, I thought that one of them was supposed to be good. Advance onwards, mighty worm. <laughs> Give me a platform to stand on by using your body. That <laughs> that does seem appropriate for most of the enemies in this game, though. <laughs> um, so, and then on to this next planet, Apple Planet. Can, can I get onto it? Nice. Nice. Um... Is there anything that actually happens from doing all this stuff? Or is it just like here to be... Yeah, I'm, I'm here. Oh, oh, wait, we did actually, actually have to do that. And I'm gonna butt stomp your nose, butt stomp your nose, butt stomp your nose, all the way to glory. <laughs> Man, I don't know either. And on to the next planet. Um, why don't we just hit that one down? Ooh, we got a life stream. Nice. Come over here, life stream. And now we have six lives. Let's go on to the next, on to the final boss. With six lives. Damn it! I heard you like, I heard you like um, landscaping, but this is ridiculous. <laughs> that, 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 that was really bad. <laughs> that was really bad. Anyway, stop digging off my lawn, you kids! Or money moles. Haha! <laughs> -ha! Take you out and smack you in your furry behind. And now his spiny top has gone to turn into a red top. Um, now come, come over here. Which, which is pretty stupid because spiny tops are a lot better than red tops. But then again, he, this guy's stupid, so he wouldn't know that. And back to the Spanish shell once again. No, why didn't... What? 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 That was BS. He freaking burrowed back into the ground. That was BS. And once again, now this time, take his... Christ damn it. Okay, this is BS right now. This is BS. Now! Eh! Uh, and... No, no, no! Furry behind! Give me your furry behind! I'm gonna smack it into next week! And oh no! My butt was destroyed! Now my pupils will be lost forever! <laughs> because... <laughs> a perfect unharmed butt equals to good awesome pupils. Thanks, you saved me, boy! And... They're doing that, we get a star. But I think with that mission, Major Burrows taken out, we are gonna end it off here because we did quite a bit in this episode. Thank you for watching from me, Abazanuki. Let's grab comment. Goodbye, and I'll see you guys next time for more Super Smash Bros. Christ. <laughs> for more. Super Mario Galaxy Somewhat Blind. Stop it from hell! Stop it, Megadon! <laughs> you hold that star fabulously, Mario. Stop killing my spin! Let me spin like a majestic pony! Screw you. <laughs>